We are back at again to see my friend. Part two of Friends All Thanksgiving episodes. You don't want to miss it. Let's get straight into it. Let's go. Hey, hey. Is it Rose, did you know that mom and dad are going to Puerto Rico for Thanksgiving? No, they're not. Yes, they are. The Blymans invited them. You're wrong. I am not wrong. You're wrong. No, I just talked to them. I'm calling Mom. Hey, hey. 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 I'm going to lie to you. The first season of, of Ross, I know he was kind of like the... The press, depression, depressing one. Um, <laughs> I don't know what you, uh, yeah. I did not like Ross. He was just too whiny. Um, I didn't start really liking Ross for like the later seasons. Um, especially when he got rid of the monkey. Yeah. But yeah, I did not like Ross starting out. He was just too whiny, man. Like, grow some, <laughs> grow some cojones, man. But yeah. From the cry for help department. Are you wearing makeup? Hey. Okay. Yes, I am. As of today, I am officially Joey Tribbiani, actor slash model. Thank you. Huh. That's so funny, because I was thinking you look more like Joey Tribbiani, man slash woman. <laughs> what are you modeling for? <laughs> Could I get that joke off today? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Can you tell it's the 90s? <laughs> What were you modeling for? Well, you know those posters for the city free clinic? Oh, wow. So you're going to be one of those healthy, healthy, healthy guys? Huh? Oh, you know, the asthma guy's really cute. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know which one you're going to be? No, no. But I hear Lyme disease is open, so, you know. <laughs> Good luck, man. I hope you get it. Yeah. Thanks. Oh, there were black people in this show. Look at that. <laughs> like, I forgot. It was... Yo, outside of, uh, God dang, uh, who's the girl? Who the... Aisha Tyler. Who was a uh, friend? Uh, Ross's girlfriend, season nine through ten. It was like, well, no blood me on this show. Downtown New York. But anyway, go ahead. My bad. <laughs> well, you were right. How can they do this to us? Oh, it's Thanksgiving. Oh, okay, I tell you what. How about if I cook dinner at my place? I'll make it just like mom's. Will you make the mashed potatoes with the lumps? <laughs> you know they're not actually supposed to. I'll work on the lumps. <laughs> Joey, you're going home, right? Yeah. And I assume, Chandler, you're still boycotting all the pilgrim holidays. <laughs> yes, every single one of them. And Phoebe, you're going to be with your grandma? Yeah, and, and her boyfriend. But we're celebrating Thanksgiving in December because he's lunar. <laughs> so you're free Thursday, then? Yeah. Oh, can I come? Yeah. <laughs> Rage, are you still thinking you're going to make it to Vail? Absolutely. Shoop, shoop, shoop. <laughs> Only $102 to go. I thought it was ninety-eight fifty. Yeah, well, it was, but I, I broke a cup. <laughs> well, I'm off to Carol's. Oh, oh, why don't we invite her? Ooh, ooh, because she's my ex-wife and will probably want to bring her ooh, ooh, lesbian life partner. <laughs> What a, what a, uh, <laughs> what a God, then, then again, like, Ross, I understand. It was like, I'll be depressed, too. Like, what do you do in that situation? What an origin story from Ross. Like, marry a girl, you have a child, and then she turns out to be a lesbian. What a, what a crazy, what a, what a crazy life there. So, you know what? My bad, Ross, for going, getting on, going in on you earlier, bro. You, you, I, I, I respect it, man. Get some therapy, bro. <laughs> I'm going to sit down and try to watch one of these things. Halftime. <laughs> hey, who wants to uh, throw the ball around a little? Maybe get a little three-on-three -three going. Oh, that would be so much fun. Oh, can I play too? I've never played football, like, ever. Great, you can cover Chandler. Huh? <laughs> no, no, I don't, I don't really want to play. Come on, man, you haven't wanted to do anything since you and Janice broke up. That's not true. I wanted to wear my bathrobe and eat peanut clusters all day. 
I want to start drinking in the morning. Don't say that I don't have goals. Chandler, you have to start getting the over The fact her, that... All right? If you play, you get some fresh air, maybe you'll take your mind off Janice. The and fact if... that he was depressed over Janice. What a... You can tell what, what time this was during the, during the series, bro. Like, what? Like, now if he heard Janice, it was like, ugh. But then, yeah, he would... He would Talk about some popcorn love. Shout out to New Edition. Uh. If you don't play, everyone will be mad at you because the teams won't be even. Come on. <laughs> I'm gonna love play. Yay! Yay! Let's do it, Ross. What? Want to play football? Um, Monica and I aren't supposed to play football. <laughs> <laughs> what? Says who? Your mom? <laughs> yeah. Yes. <Yeah. Yeah. laughs> <laughs> well, every, every Thanksgiving, um. We used to have a touch football game called the, the Geller Bowl. No, no, no. You say that proudly. <laughs> anyway, Ross and I were always captains, and um, it got kind of competitive. And one year, Geller Bowl six, I accidentally broke Ross's nose. It was so not an accident. She saw I was about to tag her, so she threw her big fat grandma arm elbow in my face. Wow! <laughs> wow! Just kept running. Just scored the winning touchdown, by the way. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. Uh, you did not win the game. The touchdown didn't count because of the spectacularly illegal... Oh, and by the way, Savage, nose-breaking. I won the game. Oh, yeah? Then how come you didn't get the Geller Cup? Ooh. <clears throat> there was a Geller, Geller Cup? Cup? Yeah. Yes, it was the trophy you got if you won the game. But our dad said, nobody won that game. And he was sick of our fighting, so we took the trophy. <laughs> threw it in the lake. And was the curse lifted? <laughs> anyway. Son, first of all, respectfully, I don't care if she broke your nose. That's football. That's what's going to happen. So technically, Monica did win. What are you talking about? Well, she broke my nose. So no, no, no. No. Nobody stopped the game of play when Joe Theismann broke his leg. Shout out to Lawrence Taylor. Well, not shout out to Lawrence <laughs> But, like, no. <laughs> like, I don't care what happened to you. That's the name of the game. What, what was that? Uh, Herm, Herm Edwards? That's the name of the game. The fuck? Uh, like, what are you talking about? <laughs> That's when Mom said we were not allowed to play football again. You know what? I think we should play a game. I mean, come on, it's been 12 years. Can I see you for a second? Okay. What? All right, we're going to play. All right. Well, wait a minute, though. How are we going to get there? Because my mom won't let me cross the street. <laughs> Taylor, always with the great one. Hey, by any chance, did either of you pick uh, Rachel for your secret Santa? Because I want to trade for her. I picked her. Oh, thank God you want her. Oh. Wow, why do you want to get rid of her so badly? Because she exchanges every gift she ever gets. Wait, it's like impossible to get something You're doing a secret Santa during likes. Thanksgiving? Come on, let's trade. Oh, no, 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 no. you doing a, a secret Santa during during Thanksgiving? Okay. Well, that's not true. That's not true. I got her that backpack, and she loved it. I remember how much she was crying the day that big dog ran off with... Well, there was no big dog. <laughs> All right, this sucks, because I already got her this briefcase, and I had RG put on it. Her initials. Uh, <laughs> well, maybe you can give it to somebody else. Oh, Ross like Ross Keller. Keller. Yeah. Oh, uh, you know what, though? It's kind of a uh, girly briefcase. Who cares? He works in a museum. Wait, oh. Hey, what time is it? The big game's about to start. I'll try to fake act like I care. do that. Ross and Joey aren't here. You can watch the parade if you want. Thanks. <laughs> What is wrong with this freezer? Ow! Ow! That's how she... Oh, my God, okay. it just got in my eye. People are trying to sleep in here. Monica got ice in her eye. Yo, and Rachel's so vain, like, son. But uh, I'm like, yo, this, this, this video compliments the first reaction I did so much better. I was like, how did Monica mess up her eye? But now I know. The more you know. Hurts. Open it up. Let me see. Oh, you know, I can't. It really kills. Well, maybe you should put some ice on it. <laughs> Ooh, it looks bad. Uh, Honey, maybe we should take you to a doctor. No, my eye doctor is Richard. I can't go to him when I don't have a boyfriend. 
He's really picky about his patients. <laughs> hey, you've got to go. What's his office number? Like, I remember his office number. Speed dial seven. <laughs> Yeah, I'm calling on behalf of Monica Geller's eye. And <laughs> is, um, is Richard Burke in today? He's out of town, but does she want to see the on-call doctor? Yes! Yes! She's very excited about that. <laughs> oh, man. Remember speed dial? I was just saying, man. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Hello? Hello? <laughs> Baby? Joey? What's going on? What? <gasps> oh my God! I know. It's stuck. How did it? How, how did it get on? Well, I put it on to scare Chandler. Oh my God! Monica's gonna totally freak out. Well, then help me get it off. Plus. Well, it smells really bad in here. I bet it does. Of course it smells really bad. You have your head up a dead animal. <laughs> Not gonna lie, thought they was gonna go a different route with that. <laughs> I'm, I'm almost like I'm almost positive they went a different. Like maybe maybe it's a Mandela effect. I really thought she was going she's gonna say something different. But anyway, go ahead. Monica. Oh. <laughs> hey yo. Hey. Hey, yo. <laughs> hey, did you get the turkey bait? Oh, my God! Oh, my God! <laughs> Who is that? It's Joey. It's Joey. <laughs> what, what are you doing? Is this supposed to be funny? No, it's not supposed to be funny. It's supposed to be scary. <laughs> oh, get that off now. I can't. It's stuck. Well, I don't care that that turkey has to feed 20 people at my parents' house, and they're not going to eat it off your head. I, hold on, okay? Let's just all think. <laughs> hey, I got it. Phoebe, you pull. I'm gonna spread the legs as wide as I can. <laughs> Joey, That's now is said. not the time. Sorry, guys. Okay, we count to three. One, two, three. Ooh. Ah! I scared you, I knew it! <laughs> I'm over here, big guy. Yeah, you are. Yeah, yeah you are. I scared you. <laughs> okay, great. Bye. So, guess who's coming to Thanksgiving dinner? Sydney Poitier? <laughs> <laughs> I miss Rachel. <laughs> no, my parents. Oh, that's great. They haven't seen the place since I moved in. Yeah, and you know, if you could not mention to them that we live together, that would be great. I was thinking we'd eat around four. I'm sorry? Why can't I tell them that we live together? Because they don't know we're dating. Do you think we should eat in the kitchen? What? Why haven't you told them? Um, well, I was going to. I, I really was. But um, then somewhere, just out of nowhere, I didn't. Uh, why haven't you told them? Wouldn't they be happy? So, dinner in the kitchen around four. I'll see you then. <laughs> why wouldn't they be happy? Well, um, because mainly, um, they don't like you. Wow. I'm sorry. What? Why? Why? <laughs> Maybe because you used to be aloof, or, or that you're really sarcastic, or that, you know, you joke around all the time, or that you take off your clothes and you throw them on the couch. Is this why they don't like me or why you don't like me? <laughs> Look, I know that I should have told them. I know I shouldn't care what they think. I'm sorry. You know what? It'll be okay. It'll be okay, because when they come over, I will be all charming. I will never, 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 <laughs> never, <laughs> never. You tell you say never. Um, I knew I wasn't going crazy. This is the episode to where uh, Ross and Monica start uh, uh, exposing secrets to their parents about different stuff. Like, uh, yeah, it was like, some something didn't mess up the turtle. Go, Monica did. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, yo, this yo, that might be you know what? I might like that episode more than the one with the, all the, the crazy Thanksgivings. I don't know. But yeah. Never. Like, I don't care. If I'm living with you, son, I ain't gonna play I ain't playing no. No. I ain't gonna how no. Mm -mm. We'll make them fall in love with me and then we'll tell them. You really think that'll work? Hey, I can be pretty charming, babe. Won you over, didn't I? <laughs> I don't think you'll ever get my parents that drunk. <laughs> hey, everybody.
Happy Thanksgiving. No, 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 no. What, are we keeping Thanksgiving a secret this year? <laughs> no, we were playing this game I learned at work. You have to name all the states in six minutes. What? That's, like, insanely easy. No, it's a lot harder than it sounds. You always forget at least one, or in some cases, 14. It's a stupid game, and I wasn't playing against other people, so technically I didn't lose. What? You forgot 14 states? Nobody cares about the Dakotas. <laughs> Oh, okay, time's up. All right, I got 48. Oh, that's not bad. Beeps? Oh, I got tired of naming states, so I decided to list the types of celery. <laughs> and I have one, regular celery. Okay, so Richard's got 48, celery? and Phoebe has the lead in vegetables. Joey? <laughs> Say hello to the new champ of Chandler's Dumb States Game. <laughs> well, how many you got? 56. <laughs> I brought you my old maternity clothes. Oh, Phoebs, that's so sweet. Oh, those are so cute. Yeah. That's right. That's when Rachel was pregnant with Ross's child, and yet somehow they're not together. And look, see how they expand as the baby grows? Oh. And then after the baby's born, they're great for shoplifting melons. <laughs> Good, you're all here. Hi. Okay, Thanksgiving tomorrow, four o'clock. How many people? Oh, Never mind. and guess who I invited? Remember that guy Will Colbert from high school? No. He was in Ross's class, marching band, was kind of overweight. Well, really overweight. I mean, I was his thin friend. <laughs> oh, wow, I don't remember him. Honey, are you sure you're not talking about your imaginary boyfriend? No, that was Jared. <laughs> Jared. I haven't thought about him in a long time. <laughs> anyway, um, Will's, Will's here on business, and he didn't have a place to go, so I invited him here. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, and by the way, he's lost a bunch of weight. I mean, he looks good. Oh, okay, mm. I mean, really, really gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Joey. I still love Chandler. Wouldn't hurt you to say it once in a while. <laughs> <laughs> that's a true friend. Shut it, Chandler. See, that's what... What about your friends? Are you gonna be around? Shout out to TLC. That that's a friend you need. Hold you down when he ain't around. You feel me? Like, yeah, hey, that's cool. You can do your little girl to girl thing, but don't, 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 don't put, put some respect on my man's name. You feel me? What we talking about? Yeah. All right. Okay. Also, just so you know, I'm not gonna make a turkey this year. What? what? Well, Phoebe doesn't eat turkey. Phoebe. Turkeys are beautiful, intelligent animals. No, they're not. They're ugly and stupid and delicious. <laughs> All right, no, it's, it's not just Phoebe. Will's still on a diet, Chandler doesn't eat Thanksgiving food, and Rachel's having her aversion to poultry. She is? Yeah, did you remember I had to leave the room the other day when you had that roast chicken? Yeah, but I thought that was just because I put the whole thing on my hand and made it walk across the table. <laughs> Anyway, it just doesn't seem worth it to make a whole turkey for just three people, okay? It's just, it's, it's a lot of work. But, but you gotta have turkey on Thanksgiving. I mean, Thanksgiving with no turkey is like, like, Fourth of July with no apple pie. Or, or Friday with no two pizzas. All right, fine if it means that much to you, but it's just, there's gonna be a ton left over. No, no, there won't. I promise I will finish that turkey. All right, you're telling me you can eat almost an entire turkey in one sitting? That's right. Because I'm a Tribbiani. <laughs> this is what we do. Right. I mean, we may not be great thinkers or, or world leaders. We don't read a lot or run very fast. But damn it, we can eat. Facts. <laughs> 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 hey, hon, would you help me get the plates down? Yeah. Hey, here's an idea. Why don't we use our wedding china today? No, I think we should save our china for something really special. Like... The Queen of England comes over. <laughs> Honey, she keeps canceling on us. Take the hint. <laughs> what if something gets broken? They're so expensive. What is the point of having them? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I've tried to hold it in. But if you watch... I, I'm a TV head. Like, I watch everything. If you watch Everybody Loves Raymond... Uh, what episode was that? Ah, I'm trying to remember the episode. But it's when... Uh, oh, I think it was when uh, they replaced the couch. Did he replace the couch or put plastic off the couch? I think it's when, okay, it's when, sidebar. 
Everybody loves Raymond. It's the episode to where I think they put the plastic off the couch. And <laughs> they were talking about why do you have guest towels if there's never if 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 if, <laughs> if you don't have guests? What's the purpose of guest towels? Like I'm sorry, it just went went into my mind. I love that episode. <laughs> he was like <laughs> Robert was trying to eat chips. It's all he heard. <laughs> so he's like eating chips, but he's so like nervous that he's that he, that the bowl of chips falls over and then gets into the couch. Anyway, my bad, my bad. That's a random thought. My, my bad, yo. Never use them. Okay, but if something gets broken and then the queen comes over, I will explain it to her. Oh yeah, like I'm gonna let you talk to the queen. <laughs> Okay. Well, the parade is really good this year. Man, those horses can crap. <laughs> oh. Next up is a marching band from Muskogee, Oklahoma. Muskogee? That's like four hours from Tulsa. Woohoo! <laughs> and here's the flow with the stars of the popular daytime soap, Days of Our Lives. <laughs> oh my god! Aren't you one of the stars of popular daytime soap, Days of Our Lives? Yeah! <laughs> God, I'm supposed to be there. I can't believe I forgot. I usually write stuff like this down on my arm. Oh, stupid long sleeves. <laughs> what are you going to do? I guess I'm going to have to come up with a really good reason why I wasn't there. The producers are going to be so mad at me. They sat us all down yesterday and said, everyone has to be there. 6 a.m. sharp. That means you, Tribbiani. <laughs> like I was some kind of idiot. Well, you proved them wrong. Yeah. <laughs> hey, guys. Hey. Hi. Hey. 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 Um, we need to talk to you about something. Yeah, we don't feel like we can host Thanksgiving this year. What? What, what? what are you talking about? about? Well, just with uh, work and the stress of adoption, we just don't feel like we have the energy. Plus, we don't think it's fair that every year the burden falls on us. That doesn't sound like you. <laughs> That's Monica talking. Huh? No, no. We made this decision together. Since putting words in your mouth. Don't you put words in people's mouths. You put turkey in people's <laughs> mouths. <laughs> I can't believe this. This is Emma's first Thanksgiving. No, it's not. It's not. When was she born? <laughs> Well, personally, I think it's great you're giving yourself a break. Thank you, Phoebes. Sure. It's just as well. I mean, last year wasn't very good. I think she's losing her touch. Wow! <laughs> wow! You are way off, lady. Am I? Really? Am I? Well, why don't you cook Thanksgiving dinner and prove me wrong? <laughs> well, think about it. Think about it. You'd be trying to top what you did last year. You'd be in competition with yourself. <laughs> That's my favorite kind. <laughs> doing this don't let yourself get manipulated this way hey, stay out of this Chandler this is between me and me <laughs> we are supposed to make these decisions together did you not watch the dr. Phil I paid for you he was around then well hold on no wait that's like oh three oh four okay never mind. he was like it's between me and me yo yo uh yeah Thank, thanks, friends, all the Thanksgiving episodes. You don't want to miss it. Like, comment, subscribe, share all, thing, share all the things, all the things. Once again, let me know what your favorite Thanksgiving episodes. Like I said in the previous video, it ha well, now, it might be the one. It's either the one where Ross got high and then it's found out. Oh, I'm like, why don't they like Chan? Okay, I literally had an epiphany. That's why they don't like Chandler, because they thought Chandler got high. That's why Monica's parents don't like Chandler, because they thought Chandler is the one that, that got high in the house. But they caught and Ross blaming on Chandler. But it was really Ross. Oh, yeah, that's right. That might be my favorite episode. Over the one with all the worst Thanksgivings. It's a toss-up. It's a toss-up. But, yeah, uh, like I said before, like, comment, subscribe, share all the things with the things. Ain't gotta go home. <laughs> competition, competition between me and me. Uh, ain't gotta go home. You gotta get the hell up out of here. Peace.
Peace. Did you tell me this was over? There ain't no use talking me over. Or can you try to tell me sooner? Or can you tell me this was over?